you could play a real part in, in this documentary series. When we first sat down and talked to topics, the first thing I remember you saying was, I want to do something about depression. Yeah. Um, obviously, it was highlighted in the Benefit Street documentary that I was suffering from bereavement depression due to losing my mother. But it's kind of, you know, the reaction you get from people is like, you don't look depressed, you're on the telly, how are you depressed? You're taking the mick out of people who really are ill. And I'm like, hang on a minute, you know, it's like, it's a mental illness, it's not a physical illness. And it is something that I am really passionate about, and I think it needs to be highlighted a lot more. So hence why this is right. the one that I feel really, really strong about. We've got a clip we can show now, as a man called John. Uh, let's just take a look at what he had to tell you. If I hadn't have been through it, I would be one of these idiots that says, you know, pull yourself together. Um, it, 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 people see it as weakness and, and, and things like that. And I think it's, it's, it's harder for men to admit that they've, they've got a, a problem. Um, what do you reckon that is? is it, you know, is it, do you think it is like the, you know, the, the more superior sort of species kind of thing? Well, or? probably. I mean, again, at the end of the day, you've got that thing where, uh, you know, uh, someone said to me not long back that, you know, if you're sitting in an office and there was a woman crying at a desk, people would go to her to find out what's going on and find out what's going on and, and you know, and there'd be no shame involved in it. But if you've got a bloke sitting at a desk crying, people wouldn't go anywhere near him. I think I mean, one of the biggest issues with, with, um, with suicide is the stigma.